Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. On my previous video, I shown you all, how to create beast title intro animation. If you are new to our channel, please click the subscribe button, and click the bell icon, to get more creative editing videos. Please check all our tutorials, it will be very easy, and you'll learn something new. In this video, I will tell how to create, beast title intro with your own names. You can download the project files from the description, let's get started. Before that, I will show you all, today what we are going to see. I am going to do this tutorial, with one of us subscriber name. You can do yourself, by the way I am explaining. Open Illustrator, and we can make in text, and now we can create the sharp edge designs, from original title. Convert the text to outline and removing the S letter, because I am going to create S from original title. I am creating the curve effect using pen tool. Then I am moving it toward text. Now I am creating S from original title using pen tool move to our text then i am going to match it with our text and i am duplicating it i am creating the curve effect using pen tool Now we have finished our full text, and now we can save this text file as SVG. Now we can import this SVG into Blender. I will give you the Blender file in the description, you can use it. After importing here, you need to change the size, press S to change the size. And also rotate it, to rotate press R, and the press X, and give 90 to rotate. Now we can give extrude, for every text using curve option. Give 0.002 for all text, if you need you can give your own value. After that we need to create a cube, and make it cover all the area, mainly it should cover the camera, because we need dark area. And we have the text, but if you need outline for text. Then we can make duplicate of these text. And now we can hide all the text, and we can give outline, select the text, and press fill mode to none like this. Now we can give materials for outline. If you don't know, how to create materials and give it to text, then please watch our next tutorial video, it will be uploaded with this video itself, so you don't need to wait. After giving materials, you can change the text fill mode, like this. And also we can change the depth to 0.0002, for the bevel on the text. We can give this for all outline texts. After that, now it's time to give lights, create an area light and do as I am doing. I am going to give animation for this light, first I will keep the light, below the text, and I will give in keyframe, then I will move the light above. And again I will give in keyframe. You can also adjust the light power and give keyframes, then we will get the result like this. If the light is in speed, then you can adjust the keyframes, by moving it to 50 frames like this. Now we can take duplicate the area light, and we can move it little bit, and we can adjust the size like this. Now we can give animation for this light, we can delete the before keyframes, and we can give new keyframes for this animation. I will keep keyframes in 50, and move the light right side, and give another keyframe in 100. You will get result like this. We can make another duplicate of this light, 
and we can do as the same for left side also. After that, I will make another area light, and move it to front of the text. Then I will give animation for this, by giving keyframes in power of the light. I will keep 0 for the power in 100, and give power as 1 for the 150 frame. After all done, we can take render, and we can bring this video to After Effects. I will give this project in description, you can use it. Then please do as I am doing here, first I will duplicate the video, and I will give freeze frame, in the last of our video. Then we can stretch the freeze frame layer like this. Then now we can bring our SVG text file here, which we created first. Then we can match the size with our video. Please match it correctly, like I do here. We should keep the illustrator file below the particle comp, and give alpha mat to the illustrator file. Your illustrator file should be in white color, otherwise we should give fill effect to this, and we can change the color. We can trim the illustrator file like this. If you give white color in here, then our particles will be changed like this. If you need more particles, you can make one more duplicate, and give alpha to it also. Our route is ready now, you can take render now. And if you have any doubt, you can ask your doubt, in below comments section, or you can message me to our Instagram, I will help you as soon as possible. That's all guys, thanks for watching this video. Please don't forget to give subscribe to our channel, your support only makes us to put more videos regularly. And if you like my videos, please give like to this video, and if you don't like please tell and comment why, I will post videos according to your comments, thank you all.